Today we are going to draw a quarter pin using SolidWorks software, and these are the dimensions which we are going, which we are going to use to design a quarter pin, as you can see in the drawing. Then I will go to SolidWorks software, select the front plane, and sketch on the front plane. First of all, I will select a center line and draw a center line. Okay, select then i'm going to draw a line then i'm going to draw a line you can see i'm going to draw a line then after that i'm going to draw a tangent arc a tangent arc you can draw by uh, then i'm going to draw a tangent arc how you can draw a tangent arc by selecting tangent arc or by selecting line or hovering over this point see I'm hovering over this point and I get a tangent arc let's finish then I'm going to mirror and then I'm going to mirror this sketch so how I'm going to mirror the sketch I'll go and select mirror entities and then I will select the entities which I have to mirror so I'm going to select this one this 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 line and this arc mirror about the center line so it has been mirrored now again I want to draw a tangent arc so I'm going to select tangent arc from here and then I draw a tangent arc like this it's done now I'm going to add dimensions so dimension from this line to this line is 2.5 mm so i'm going to add 2.5 mm to this dimension okay then dimension of this arc is 10 mm so i'm going to add 10 mm and dimension of this arc is 5 mm I'm going to add 5 mm over here okay and then dimension from this point to this point is 100 mm see now still it is saying the sketch is under defined as you can see from here at the bottom so what I'm going to do I'm going to select this point Control select this point on the XY axis and okay, some smart dimension has been selected. So, how I'm going to see is here at uh, showing under defined. So, how I'm going to uh, fully define it. So, I'm going to select this point, this point, and this point and add relation vertical. See, not is fully defined. A sketch has been fully defined now. I will exit the sketch okay then I'll select the right plane and sketch on it so on the right plane I will draw a circle of diameter 5 mm why I'm drawing circle of diameter 5 mm because I want the profile of the quarter pin see you can see this profile this profile I want like this profile for the quarter pin so that's why I'm selecting uh, that's why I'm drawing a circle on the right plane so I've got to add uh, a dimension to this circle 5 mm then I'm going to draw a line a cord along the circle uh, after I've drawn a cord horizontal cord select then I'm going to add dimension for the cord so the dimension of the cord from the center point is the distance of the cord from the center of the circle is what is the distance one second let me enlarge it okay the dam the distance of the cord from the center of the circle is 1 mm and then I'm going to trim entities this is uh, this is the unwanted sketch and I'm going to remove it see finish see what we wanted this one we have drawn this 
as you can see in the bottom of the drawing you can see the profile 2.5 mm diameter and 1 mm the cord is at 1 mm distance from the center of the circle same thing we are doing over here it's showing underdefined no issues let it be underdefined okay then let's check check this one and now i'm going to just uh, adjust my drawing a little bit and i'm going to select the center point of the cord okay and select this sketch understood and then i'm going to add relation peers like this now i'm going to now it's showing fully defined after add if after add peers relation then i'm going to exit the sketch and after i have exited the sketch i'm going to use the swept boss base command see in the swept boss base command it has automatically in sketch profile it has automatically taken sketch number three sketch number three is nothing but the sketch of the uh, sketch of this profile okay if it is not it has not taken automatically in your solidworks then you can select it from here and circle profile i'm going to select this sketch the skeleton of quarter profile see now it is done so this is how we design a quarter pin and i'm going to add a yellow color on this quarter pin so select a yellow color and add a yellow color to make it beautiful so this is a quarter pin thank you very much